In this video, I'll show you how to submit an assignment. Go into my course. I'll go ahead and use assignments. There's other ways to get to them. There's assignment 4.1. That's the one I'll show you how to do this. The assignment is actually a master template in Google Sheets. There's a link here. I'll click on that link. And it may ask me which account I want to use. If it does, I'll want to use my my uh, college account. You might get a dialog box at this point. I didn't, so I'll just say I'll use the app. It'll open the spreadsheet. Ah, here we go. Uh, here's where I want to use my college account. That's a dialog box I was looking for. Now, this particular file, when I tap on it, it says view only at the bottom. I can't edit it. You can't edit it because this is the master file. You have to make a copy. So to do that, I'm going to go up to the three dot menu at the upper right I just tapped on and there's share and export I'll go to share and export and I will make a copy I'll probably want to give it a unique name so I don't get confused with the master template later when I go to submit my assignment so I'll add my initials to this assignment it'll land in my drive but you can of course select somewhere else to put the file if you wish to that's a good place for me to have it uh, Cancel that. I don't need to put it anywhere else. I'll just put it in my drive. You may later organize your drive. Now I'm working in my copy of the file. I can see the homework and read the directions, scroll around. This homework was fairly simple. I'm going to make a scatter graph, so let me do that. Just for fun, put in the XY scatter graph. That's the wrong chart. I've got to go find a scatter graph around here. There we go. That's the chart I want. And there, that's the chart. So, I've got my file. That's this homework in total. Uh, what I do want to do now is submit it. And I've got a couple options available to me. Potentially, I could use share and export and run a save as. And then I can save it in a number of different formats. And that's probably the easiest way to do this at this point. I'll go ahead and I can save it as an Excel or PDF. But I'll go ahead and export it as an Excel file. But the complication with this is, as you'll see in a moment, uh, that file was just created in my drive, not on my phone. I won't be able to load that, upload that because it's not sitting in my downloads folder. So that won't actually work uh, because it's sitting, let me show you where that is now. That's actually sitting in my drive. If I go back to here, this file here is the XLX file. These are two files, this one here. That's the Excel file I just created. That won't work, but I went back and I can now download it if I want to. However, I didn't need to do that. I can download the original file here. Just press check and the arrow back. Click that three dot and I can download directly from the Google document. So that's the Google document there with the Google symbol. The one with the Excel symbol is the Excel one. Let me download that just to download both, just to show you there's two different files. That's the key. You have to download it because what I'm going to do then, I'm going to switch screens and go back to my student view here and submit the assignment. And you'll see I get file upload as my only option. And I'll go to my device. And here you can see both files are here. One came down as a PDF. That's the Google Sheets file. The other came in as an Excel file. I can upload either one. They should both work. I'll let you know if they don't. I know the PDF will work. But let's go ahead and upload the this uh, Excel file. That should also work. And so I'm uploading that one file. Oh, it uploaded. Okay. So with that, I've uh, submitted my assignment. I'm done here. I can now leave and go on to whatever else I want to work on. Let me come out of the student mode for a moment. That's it. Yeah, I got to go back to my uh, 
canvas instructor mode and go have a look at what just came in. That came in under assignments 4.1. Now I can see there's something that needs grading. Submissions. Move that out of the way. And go over here and see the submissions. Test student. Open that up. And there's a file. Now, you recall that was the Excel file, but I could have also used a PDF. They both would have worked, and then I can grade it, put comments on it, do whatever I need to do. So this will work also. But whether you download it uh, from the Google or whether you do a Save As and download the Excel file, whatever works for your phone. But you do have to download it and upload it. There, you can't bring it across directly from Sheets. You've got to go back to the to the other window and download and upload. You've got to go back to the starting screen for Sheets, the organizer, if you will. Download and upload.